a Diddy. Did he do it? Basically, that's what they said on the internet. Is it over for the music mogul? And do you feel he's guilty of all the accu accusations? Can he bounce back? Mark. Oh. It, it, Can he bounce back? Guilty of what? Being gay? Like, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's, 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 seriously. So, what did he do? He, he, um, so, they're saying that he had like um, sex slaves or whatever, but that right. he was paying them. So, I guess there's that. But the way everybody's coming down on him, like, I, w I even I was a part of it, you know, because it's funny, you know, f seeing 50 post stuff and everything like that. But sure, yeah, true. Think about how many people in the industry are doing the same thing. Are they talking about them? Nah. Yeah, yeah. So the way that they're trying to bring him down, like, I'm not really feeling it like that. And I know he's probably put a lot of people through bad times. Sure. Put a lot of people through shit. But I, not guilty of crimes. I mean, I guess prostitution is a thing. So, yeah. like maybe like he uh is gets a racketeer in charge, maybe he gets like a pros like a prostitution or human trafficking type thing. Yeah. But for him to lose everything, no, nah, I don't feel like it's worth it. You don't feel like what about you, Alexa? Hmm. Um being in the like in the industry, in the modeling industry, you get to see a lot of different things and yeah, it's true it does happen and a lot of celebrities are like that. Yeah. And um with with Diddy, I I think it's true. You think I it's think true? I know it's well, I think it's true. So yeah. you think uh so what do you think he did? Um a lot of people are doing that. Um, celebrities, from boxers, from multimillionaires. I don't want to say much, but yeah. yeah, yeah, no, it's true. They, they, um, it, it is like it's like a, it's a big thing. Like you know, people selling people. It's yeah, it's a lot of money that they get off of that, and people are doing it. Celebrities, yeah, I, really I think big people. Uh, I, I kind of agree with both of you. I think it's an interesting take. Uh, did he do it? I know that's like a, a hashtag trend right now. Uh, you, you, did you want to say something? Yeah, I can wait. Okay, okay. When you get a chance, get on the mic. Uh, I just I think that Diddy possibly is getting a lot of the heat for how he treated people in the past. A I little agree. bit of what Mark was saying, and I think they they are using that to kind of extoriate him, right? To just uh, kill his uh, character, character assassination, so to speak. I don't really know if he truly committed crimes uh, because I'm not there. But I just think that he's done so many people dirty in a way that it offended them that it's just kind of hitting him. I think the Cassie situation really made it bad for him. The Cassie. Yeah. Because he, the next day, he's, you know, he's settled. And he's, he still keeps saying that, you know, I'm innocent. But for me, for you, the type of wealth that you have, and you, I would fight that. There's no reason that I would just settle. To, it can't go away. It's already out in the public. Everyone knows about it. It's on Shade Room, ABC, Fox, CNN, whatever. The, the whole the, Cassie situation, I felt like that was blood in the water and there were nothing but sharks around. Yeah, so okay. I think that sparked this whole thing because if he wouldn't have settled right then and there. Exactly. Um, and let's say he would have beat it, then nothing would have happened. Nothing would have happened. The fact that he paid millions of dollars to her, mm -hmm. everybody's all like, oh, let me get a bag because we know he did scandalous stuff, right? Of course. But the thing is, is like, I don't know, man. I, I think a lot of the people were uh, willing participants, especially the men, because you couldn't convince me to walk down the hallway and do some, some gay stuff to me. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, which is what people are trying to pin on him and everything. Like, yeah. the whole Meek Mill situation, that's crazy. <laughs> Having another man call you daddy, that's wild. Yeah, well, yeah. And then Meek's on the record talking about, I don't want to say what you and I did or something like that. Like, what, nah, what, 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 what are you talking I, about? I, I hope they forgive me what I did yeah, with Diddy. I hope they forgive me for what I did with Diddy. And I'm like... What the, what you hey, did with Diddy? Hey man, what did out, you do? Shout, shout out to gay people, but like, <laughs> yeah, I like that plug. Yeah, real, real real talk. Like, um, I don't know, man. Is it gonna be enough to where he could recover? I don't know. He showed his shares to revolt. When I saw that, I was all like, oh, it might be a wrap. Yeah, that's a lot. Yeah, yeah, that's, votes a big thing. Yeah. yeah. Um. Yeah. No. Um. Well, in my opinion, um, I don't know if you guys seen it, but Ryan Garcia had said this way before that this was gonna happen with Diddy. Really? So yeah. Um. I don't know if you know about that, but the boxer no. Ryan Garcia, he was stating right now he's going crazy viral right now because everything he's saying it's true it's coming true people are claiming he's crazy or mm -hmm. whatever but everything he's saying has been coming true <laughs> go ahead mark he go ahead actually or no go ahead finish alexa go, go ahead go, finish. you could go 
I think that nigga trying to get out of the fight. Who uh, like you? Th- that. You think he's trying to get out of the he's fight? Trying to get out of the Devin Haney fight. He's trying to do whatever. He's like, I'm crazy. Like Illuminati, they raping people yeah. over here. Like, so, but so it's true but though. The, but everything the, he has said it has hey, come true. Hey, First Diddy, I mean, then the that, Baltimore you, a bridge. He had claimed that way you, before. You could say the same thing about Orlando Brown because he has said that he had a, a sexual relationship with Diddy and Drake. Oh my God, he and did all this stuff. So yeah. Like, Yes, there's truth in everything, but I don't think Ryan Garcia knows like that. You feel me? You don't think Ryan C- Garcia because he man, he's big, bro. He's big time. Like he's in the inner circle. I'm I'm sure he's been part of these parties and things like that. And he's seen things that he's like, ah, I don't I know. I know a lot of people that have seen things. Yeah, and they 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 keep their mind about them. I think he's trying to get out of the fight. And oh, if he you- don't if he don't win this fight, then I think it's a kind of a wrap for him. Okay, all right. No, I think, well, he went to the Bohemian Grove, so he's stating that after being there, he witnessed a lot of different things that have happened. Mm-hmm. Bohemian Grove? Huh? Bohemian Grove. Oh, crazy. Yeah, it's like a cult. Yeah, that's, that yeah, is crazy. It's yeah. like really big, powerful people that yeah. are in it. Yeah. So um, he everything he has been stating, like on Twitter or talking about, has been coming true. First, he stated that the Baltimore um, bridge was going to collapse down, and he it said, did. He said that before it collapsed? Before it collapsed, okay. and Check he said the that, date dude. and everything. A date? Uh, he said the date and everything, and it actually came true. It so then like now he, he stated... <laughs> That's Anita said it wasn't... <laughs> Was it AI? They're saying, Google that, Anita. Yeah, they're saying that um, everything in the Bohemian Grove, everything is planned you, for a distraction. You, you saw this personally, like on Twitter, or you like saw yeah on, on like Twitter a, a video on TikTok. No, on Twitter. Okay, from their page. Yeah, I did yeah. see that he had been tweeting a bunch of stuff, but I didn't really go in depth to read. Yeah, into I it. said that he was going, yeah. and people were saying that he was crazy. Right. I don't know, man. At some point in time, are you crazy if you're telling people w- what you well, experience? Here's the thing. First of all, I want to say sex trafficking, human trafficking is rampant in this country and across the globe. Sure. And that's a serious thing. Yeah. And all of these people that know about it, there's a slogan where they say, you see something, say something. And yeah. a lot of people are failing to say something. Mm-hmm. And when they wait all this time and finally say something, people doubt them and people don't believe them. Wow. You know? Um, and I agree with Mark how if, once this Cassie situation came to light, if Diddy wouldn't have settled, nobody else would have come after him again. And I don't know if he's guilty or not, but I feel like if they had hard, solid evidence on him, they would have arrested him. They would have had an arrest yeah, right I mean, then he's and there. in Miami hanging out. And I, two, he has the money. If he has the money to fight it, he can fight it. But it's a long fight because it can go up to seven years you know what and I he think, can lose all his money. You know money. what I think uh, Diddy uh, guilty of? Okay. Being an asshole. That's what you think it yeah. is? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I mean, he, the way he's treated, like, his artists and things yeah. like that, not paying him back. I think he's done horrible back. things, but I, I really think if they had something concrete, they would have arrested him already. It's kind of like the same with Trump, bro. Like, like, Trump is guilty of being, like, an idiot and an asshole, but yeah. he's not really guilty of anything. What he's guilty of is, like, saying that his property is more expensive than it is. Which is like what everybody does. Like name somebody that doesn't do that, right? In my opinion, I th- well, Diddy is like the biggest person right now in the industry, the most wealthiest person right now in the industry, and um, in my opinion, I think he's gonna be like the new um, Jeffrey. Uh, what Jeffrey is uh, Epstein. 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 You yeah, think so? I think so. Mm. Yeah, everything. So, I think it's true. Jeffrey, Ep- Jeffrey Epstein had underage girls. That was the big thing about him. And yeah. he flew them around on his plane. Right, and he right. recruited them from high school. It was, like, way crazier. Right. Like, Diddy paid people. Like, and they knew it. They were with it. You know what I'm saying? This is interesting, this is interesting yeah. because you, you, from the stories that they say about Diddy, who knows what he's done? I mean, you know, R. Kelly, you're right, for an right. example. I'm a, mi- a big R. Kelly fan. And sometimes I don't even want to play the music because I don't want to hear the stigma from everybody talking crazy. But he got bops. It sucks. You really can't. I know. To the music <laughs> he no got more. he got so much good music. Yeah. Of course, and he, he knows, got twelve play. He got twelve play. Like <laughs> yeah. you know, like oh it's, it's and it's it's tough. Like you don't know what's behind closed doors, right? You just right. don't know. Yeah. You don't know, and that's Bill thing. Cosby. Yeah. Now, that's another thing. I don't know. I don't. I, I'll get into that another or, time. I mean, if you want to get into all that, then there's the whole thing with Quiet on the Set. You oh know, man, I've, quite just, a, I've, I've seen the whole thing. Oh, yeah. I'm on, I'm on uh, the fourth episode right yeah. now, so I haven't seen that's the fourth. That's the final one. one. Yeah, 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 fourth is, is fourth yeah, episode. Yeah, but man, I really yeah. feel bad for that for uh, Drake. Yeah, yeah Drake, Drake, man. Drake Bell, right? Yeah, I feel yeah. bad for him, dude. Yeah, yeah uh, that was tough. That was tough to watch. But that was that's a hard I, watch. Yeah, that's that was. What I'm saying though, like, 
people have watched all along, they just don't say anything because they're afraid of the power. Mm-hmm. And yes, they do bad things, but sometimes it's bad things that they do. It's not actual crime that they're committing. So right. like we don't actually know unless until it all comes out later and all these people come speaking you need, later. You yeah. need concrete evidence. Yeah. Not you got to have that, yes. And yeah. if you just come with hearsay, then you can get blackballed like what everybody be talking about. And it's a real thing, you yeah. know, especially when you got power and money. Yeah, and I think Diddy sold those revolt shares because one, he's gonna need the money to fight it. Oh yeah, <laughs> and if, yeah that, and I didn't think about that. And if yeah. and if he held on to them, like the value of that would probably drop. Alexa, you are you saying mean? he's guilty? I'm saying he's guilty. Alexa, out of it, and you saying undecided? I, I'm gonna wait until everything is out because, like I said. It, Again, and guilty. Look, it's a undis- distraction because look, they're gonna everything, even from like political people, were at the B- Bohemian Grove, right? Yeah, so I think this is all a big distraction. Um, for with, with Diddy, I think they just raided his house. Why didn't they check his plane when it left? Why didn't they check that? Why did they raid the, their house for like his house for like five hours, and then they didn't check where he was actually going? He's not arrested either. He's he was never been and arrested. And it was his daughter's house in L.A. Hey, you know you know what's crazy. crazy is what it she is says crazy. is yeah. I kind of agree with it. If you want to put on you know tinfoil hat and everything, like yeah, maybe this is a distraction. To, politics. To, yeah, to to get you away from the politics on like Biden Trump. On the Ukraine, we send them billions over there. On it's true. On, on the whole Russia thing. Yeah, right now, Alexa. three, three, um, three uh, Russian, what was it, ships that has sailed, mm-hmm. um, warships that were, were sailed. So this is like a big distraction. And then people that are weak, like, they just fall for it. Yeah. But if you actually open your eyes and see what's going on around the world, it's crazy. There's a, a report, well, she's a reporter. I followed her for a long time. And a lot of um, news outlets kind of, like, shy away from her so she started reporting on a sub stack and on her instagram and now she's has like this huge following and she tries to cover stories that she feels are significant and things are being used as distractions wow and um her handle is called house and habit and her name's jessica Krause. and she covers everything from the epstein thing to diddy to politics everything with trump rfk jr like biden everything you can think of she's delves into has she been right so far everything's been accurate yeah and i think she's made me um feel regarding politics how everything is so one-sided and it shouldn't be you should really delve deep into each person's story and yeah see really what's going on and look at the back history don't believe everything that you see out there just do the research for yourself that's kind of the way i am too man like i'm not a republican i'm not a right. democrat Same. i'm in the middle and it's like you have to judge each person off of their character and who they are right and what are the better options it's just crazy though because like we're so divided as a country so but, divided but it feels like that's on purpose and we are supposed to be the united states <laughs> united united yeah. so uh segwaying are you voting this year yeah. You're going to vote? You're going to vote this year? Yeah, of course. I'll you vote, vote. You I vote? vote every year. You vote every year. And I take my yeah. kids so they can see me vote. Yeah. All right. All right. I'm not going to ask anyone their political beliefs or anything like that. So, yeah. but yeah. I vote all over the place. I think you should always place, exercise so you vote. Know. Joseph, you voting? <laughs> all right, good. Yeah, okay. I, I vote all over the place yeah. too, man. You, yeah. It's like, you got to, like I tell people all the time, like the main election is Low-key local, a, a distraction. <laughs> vote local. Vote local. Right. That's, sure. the, that's the only thing that's going to um, improve where you're at and right. affects you, especially right. the Directly. local laws. Yeah, because yeah. Yeah. you can look at the local vo- voter turnout and... It's always small. It's always small. <laughs> it's like 2,800 people. I'm like, hello? And then you're all like, when did this law yeah. get passed? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because so yeah, 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 you didn't go vote. <laughs> we, yeah. we, we needed the whole city. Uh, we're going to take a quick break. 